Pierce wants his English classroom to reflect his welcoming personality, so he covered up the gray concrete walls with decorations. He says they give the room a warm coffee shop feel, and the relaxed setting helps students open up. WDEF News Elves Joe Legee introduces us to this week's Golden Apple Award winner. What is the mission of this poet? They may not all grow up to pen the next great American novel, but after leaving Mark Pierce's class, these students will at least know how. I didn't really know how to, you know, read literature at a deeper level, and you know, Mr. Pierce is really good at uh, allowing us to see the deeper meanings that uh, stories of literary merit show, so we can actually, you know see what they reveal about life. With graduation the ultimate goal, Pierce makes it his mission to do whatever it takes to reach a student. He says the simple act of kindness goes a long way. There is a struggle, there's a challenge at times, but you respect the student, you show kindness, the student's pretty much going, going to get on board with what you're doing. Pierce wants his students to work hard for him and for themselves. That's what will got her. Your vision doesn't change. It will, it will keep you steady as you go. Along with words of encouragement, Pierce regularly asks his class to wow him, providing motivation to work doubly hard to achieve. And I sense that from my students, uh, and I appreciate that probably more than, than anything I see out of my students, is their, their desire to um, want to work for me, want to um, not, not to displease me. Pierce's influence extends beyond the classroom. He encourages benevolence by offering students extra credit when they donate canned goods to a local mission. Any other shades of meaning in this poem? Years from now, Pierce wants to be that one teacher that students remember for the difference he made. He's seriously changed my life, honestly. He's been the best teacher I've ever had. And um, he's, he's just very supportive and wants us to bring more of ourselves out to not just the class, but in our whole lives. In Catoosa County, Joe Legue, WDEF News 12. We've profiled 30 teachers from across the Tennessee Valley since September, and we're going to announce the finalists for Teacher of the Year early next month. But congratulations to all of this school year's Golden Apple Award winners.